Okay, so I've got my nice glasses on, but um, we're out here today mowing a few yards, and uh, it actually came a downpour just then. So we're going to let everything dry up a little bit, and I was actually going to test out on this grass right here. I just bought them the brackets for next blades, and I was going to see how that done on the wet grass. So I'm going to mow four strips or so out here in the field see what it looks like if it's clumped up if it leaves anything behind um, then i'm going to stick the x blades on mow four strips and see what they look like see if there's a difference in any of it um, right here is the mower we're using it's a hustler fast track 60 inch cut uh, 27 horsepower Kohler efi um, so that's it, and we're using, right now we're using regular just Oregon high lift blades, and the other ones that I've got to go on there is the gator blades for it. Um, but I'm gonna mow four strips and then change these blades as fast as I can so this grass doesn't dry or anything and make it different, but we're gonna see what they look like. So we just made four passes with the regular high lifts. I'm gonna stick on the gator blades with the high lift and see what happens here. difference that we got um, first four goes from right here to there that's with the high lift blades and these four are with the X blades um, it was about probably three minutes difference in the time from the time we mowed and it just rained for days 
so on the cut I mean it is basically all the same didn't really leave any on either cut um, we do have some clumps in this one not bad there's a few clumps in these first four looks like it did leave one big one here a couple big ones but I mean mowing fast you're going to expect to leave a couple um, here's some clumps here's one big clump um, and where we've done the X blades there's basically no clumps at all it looks basically perfect some of these weeds were very tall here's just what it looks like from the other angle And for the X blades and these four other plain high lift. Um, overall, I think X blades definitely look better um, from the reviews and stuff I've seen. They use a little more gas, um, but I don't know. I mean, that looks pretty good for this wet wet grass right now. So. I think I'm going to leave them on for the rest of the day, mow the yards that we have to mow today with the X-Blades again. I actually used them last week some and it rained all last week on us too. They seem to do good. Um, try not to mow in super wet grass but it seems like in southeast Kentucky where we're at right now it basically rains every single evening it feels like. So, you gotta mow some wet grass sometimes. But, I'm gonna get everything blowed off the mower, get it ready to go. We're gonna head on to the next yard. Hopefully, this sun stays out for the rest of the day and we can get some grass cut. But, that's my review of the X blades, running a high lift on the bottom, gator blade on the top. And I don't know, I can't complain a bit with that. That looks, looks very good to me, so. We're going to keep running it and see what happens. Here's the yard I just cut. Um, still very wet grass. Uh, as you can see, it's sticking all over the mower. Down here on the tires and everything. But this yard was fairly high. We've had about at least a week of rain. Um, this is with the X blades right here. It looks pretty good. I mean, there's very, very little clumping. It looks like right in here, you can see just a little bit of clump, nothing major. But, um, I feel like before, I feel like before when I was running just the regular high lift blades, this would have definitely been a double cut right here. And I don't see any reason to go over it again. I mean, maybe a couple spots here and there to go over, but not the, not the whole thing like it usually is. So I think overall it may use a little more gas initially um, but overall in this wet grass I don't think you can beat it um, it's doing really good I've still not got to try the X blades on dry grass I don't know if it's going to be an advantage then or not but wet grass I definitely think the X blades are where it's at um, I don't know there's no reason to use more gas if there's not much a difference in dry but 
I'm gonna continue running these all day, see how all the other yards look. Um, and then I'll, I'll try them in the dry and see what they look like. But so far I'm impressed.